talking about the railway tracks that are uh, abandoned right next to the water. Apparently, we're talking about how they're permanent, they're not going to be removed for some reason, and so we're figuring out what we can do with that. So we're thinking of uh, using one of those mine carts, or think about Mario Party, you know, those little, <laughs> what, can we, what can we do, what can, how can we gain value from that? So what, why don't we have races, why don't we exercise there, why don't we have mini competitions, meet up there every Friday, whatever. Uh, so then we went to, we're talking about how um, Gastown itself is pretty dense and it has, you know, the, the height of the buildings aren't, are fairly similar among Gastown, so why don't we have these little suspension bridges or little walkways from the rooftops? And what can we do with that? Well, there's no street lights, maybe I'll uh, uh, enforce uh, collaboration and the community, especially because there's a lot of design in that sound, so maybe that'll facilitate that. Maybe it will be uh, pop-up restaurants, uh, potluck space, um, and from that we had another idea, and we're talking about the steam clock. So again, something unique about gas sound, what can we do with that? Uh, maybe uh, there will be colored steam, or it will heat, it'll create, it'll heat actually people in the winter. It will, um, maybe we'll blow it up or pretend to blow it up with like 3D projection or something. Um, then uh, one idea, this was, uh, oh yeah, okay, here, another one unique to, to Gastown. There's a lot of cobblestones in Gastown. So um, one thing that women do is that, well, they have high heels, so they're always looking and they don't want to, they don't want to trip or anything, right? So they're always looking down, and uh, what if the cobblestones had messages on them, or what if we could communicate with the cobblestones? And then uh, one thing that was actually more general, uh, just to sum this up, uh, we were thinking of the alleys, and we think the alleys are a big potential for use of space. It's neglected, so um, what about, like when you are talk earlier about empathy, creating empathy gets people really connected, so we are thinking of adopting an alley and then what that can create with the community. What would you do in the alleys? Um, we'll just uh, adopt it and maybe a, a company would be responsible for that alley and just recreate it, like illuminate it, or just, just uh, what would you do if you adopted? Like the community and the residents yeah. themselves can sort of take ownership and responsibility yeah. and make that their own and inject yeah. take care of, of it. their and personality and the, the feel of the community into yeah, yeah, yeah. Make it their own. And awesome.